Thirteen Fake Productions, along with the Man K Sports Podcast. With your host, Wild Carmon presents Wild Stats. Yes, sir. It's your boy Wildcard Mario in the building, and you are tuned in to another episode of Wow, 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 Wow Stats. Of course, I'll be dropping y'all the numbers, the figures, them stats in any type of sports topic that'll make you go wow. That shit, wow. So let's get down to business. As y'all know by now, Ja, Ja Wick, <laughs> Ja with the stick. John Morant got himself suspended. So, 25 games just handed down to him by Adam Silver. But let's look at this from the money side, all right? Now, he's suspended without pay, of course, for the 25 games, and it's effective immediately. So he can't be around the facility, can't be around the teammates, none of that. Gotta stay away, and it's going to cost him some bread. It's going to cost him some bread. It really is. So this is the first year that his max deal kicks in. Five years, $194 million. Now, also remember that that $194 million could have got bumped up $39 more million dollars had Jai made an all-NBA team, which he didn't this past season. So first year of that five-year $194 million bag kicking in. Break this down with the suspension. So, quarter of his paycheck or 25 games worth comes out to about 304,000. Oof, I don't know about y'all. 304,000 can do wonders for your kid over here for real. So, after the 25 games is totally served, it's 7.6 million dollars. Man, that's a that's a hefty, hefty fine. <laughs> <laughs> for toting the gun. Yeah, that's that's pretty hefty. Pretty hefty for your boy. Well, let's look at this from the situation of the Memphis Grizzlies because now I'm going to throw some stat out there and I'm not saying that the Memphis Grizzlies are going to be able to recreate what they've been able to do for the past two seasons and Ja has missed time. But I am just going to put out there that is precedent for the Memphis Grizzlies to show that they can be high without Ja. So, y'all ready for this? Let's go. So, over the last two seasons, including postseason games, Ja has missed 50 of them. Yeah, that's a lot of games. A lot of games, including postseason. Important games, too. Overall, 33-17 and 17 record. So they fared pretty well, fared pretty well overall, 33 and 17 record. That also includes a 20 and 5 streak back in 2021, 2022. And the reason why I'm pointing that out because 20 and 5 equals what? 25 games. So there's precedent of what they are able to do in a 25 game stretch without Ja. All right. <laughs> and when you think about it, there also is a a history moment because in that 25 game stretch they were without their 25 point score or more and that is some history for that ass right there but this past season they did go 11 and 10 without Ja so kind of dipped a little bit but still over 500 so that's why I'm saying take the stats as you may but there is precedent that they're able to survive at least a 25 game stretch without Ja. And all that is contingent, of course, how the general manager does their job. You know, still got the draft coming up, free agency. And all these stats I just said can mean absolutely a damn thing. Or it can also mean a blueprint for the Memphis Grizzlies. But. Let's get up out of here. I'm going to shut this joint down because your boy got other stats to go chase. And y'all know what it is. Go tap in with all the 613 fave content on the YouTube channel. I mean, 
content for days, especially Sports Saturday. D Man Cave Sports Podcast, Sucker Ish, D Hollywood Rant, and of course, Wow Stats with your boy and G Money's Bet. A full day of great sports content. Tap in with us. Hey, with the wild card mind, I gotta go chase some stats. Like I said, I'm up out of here. Peace and love.